the spirit of the Lord is upon me because he has anointed me to bring good news to the poor he has sent me to proclaim release to captives and recovery of sight to the blind to let the oppressed go free to proclaim the year of the Lord's favor The priest as person is firstly one who exudes genuine love and concern for all. Jesus said, I give you a new commandment that you love one another. Just as I have loved you, you also should love one another. This is the love this love is an overpowering force for communicating the reality of the divine presence in human relationships not only is the priest a eucharistic minister sacramental mentor announcer of the biblical promises of god prophetic voice and missionary of redemption he is also a friend in fellowship ready to share in the daily life and events of those who serve. He is an icon of joyful affirmation, acceptance and peace. He glows with faith in God, putting his trust in the right people. I have come that they may have life and have it abundantly. Giving life includes healing, reconciling, and uniting. Paul says, Be united in your convictions and united in your love with a common purpose and a common mind. The unity of mind and heart that Paul urges can be fostered by the priest in his dealing with families and communities Jesus calls for complete self-giving and surrender for anyone who wants to save his life will lose it but anyone who loses his life for my sake and for the sake of the gospel will save it the priest as minister is totally given in the service of others his own life shining with the surrender to the lord in all aspects of body and soul so that his spirit filled single mindedness of purpose is evident in word and deed As an effective preacher, confessor and communicator, the priest's wisdom overcomes barriers of various kinds. It was God who reconciled us to himself in Christ and entrusted it to us the work of handing on this reconciliation. So, we are ambassadors for Christ. The priest is therefore a social activist. inspiring social action valuing partnership and collaboration facilitating instead of controlling so that equality is held over class and caste divides the priest called to form himself so that his heart and his life are confirmed to the Lord Jesus in this way of becoming a sign of the love God has for each person